Joey Fame just joined us. Welcome back to Joseph Bar, and we're back with another digital circus reaction video. Today is the mystery of Milton Hall Manor. Let's watch the video! Alright, what are we doing today? <laughs> I can't hold it any longer. Sure you can. We can't die from oxygen deprivation, remember? But it still feels like I'm gonna die. Try not thinking about it. Or you could toughen up. I want to see what your funny cartoon body does. Hey, take it easy. Oh, take it easy. That's you. Alright. Here I go. <gasps> All right, we've entered the blue zone. Hey, there's something new. Okay, we're getting red. Oh, orange. Yellow. Green. Whoa, look, now she's turning blue. She was already blue. <laughs> huh. Guess the hue shift just gets faster. Why am I the one doing this? Why not one of you guys? Because something different happens with each person. For instance, Kinger starts glowing, Ragatha's hair noodles stick up, Gangle's mask starts spinning, okay. and Zubal turns straight. My limbs straighten up and fuck off. What about <laughs> 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 I want to keep the mystery alive. What do you, the viewers, think it is? Will you stop doing that? Okay, that's not Why is everybody just standing around when there's adventure to be had? Today's adventure is it? the mystery of Mildenhall Manor! No that's right. <laughs> this spooky mansion has been rumored to be filled to the brim with paranormal activity! It's up to you to solve the house's deep mysteries right. and Dang. capture all the ghoulish ghost activity you can! And for the first time ever, you can! <laughs> Where's Zubal? I made this adventure really cool and uh, mature, just for them. Where's the bitch gone? Oh, are you okay? What? The NPCs aren't going to become self-aware in this one, right? How should I know? I'm not the boss. Oh wait, yes I am. <laughs> anyway, everybody <laughs> use the noise. It's adventuring time. Let's go. Oh, this place is spooky. I wonder how hard Kane's going to go with the Ooh, scare factor. Scary. I hope this adventure doesn't end up being another horrible nightmare. I'm not really a fan of horror, and I don't really handle jump scares that well. Oh, <laughs> Come on! Oh, Jesus! Why? Are you scared of the vacuum cleaner, too? Hey, be nice to her. She's had a rough couple of days. Her and everyone else. Right, Gangle? <laughs> Does anybody hear that? What? What the fuck? Hi, I'm ghostly. Well, um, and I'm okay, ghostly. Today. Why won't they go back in? <laughs> I remember my first wild take. I don't know why they're not retracting though. That didn't happen for me. Before you continue on your adventure, you have to choose which door you're gonna go through. The door on the left is the normal door. Rated wow for all ages. The door on the <laughs> right <laughs> is the really wow. scary door. Rated hot for mature Zubal. <laughs> 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 Why the jacks? What? And then we're supposed to capture all the ghosts. Uh, which door should we choose? Right. Hmm, not sure. Let's try this out. <laughs> Don't worry, Gangle, I'll get it for you! Oh! oh shit! <laughs> what? Oh, shit. that's the scary door! Zubo, come on out! I just want to talk to you! Hmm. Oh, I know! What the, uh, could you have done that the whole time? Zubal, I, I just want to get to the bottom of why you keep skipping all my amazing adventures. You could end up really hurting Bubbles' feelings. Uh, yes. Bubbles' feelings? Enough about Bubbles' feelings! How about your feelings? I, so, what's on your mind, Zubal? I... would rather not. <laughs> That's hilarious! Go on. Very funny. No, I mean, 
I've already told you what my problem is. You just never remember because... Oh, never mind. My mind is a beeswax polished coconut. Nothing <laughs> ever sees these cakes. So what can I do to make my adventures more appealing to you? See? This is exactly what I'm talking about. All you're thinking about is your adventures. It has nothing to do with the adventures. It's more just... Ugh, forget it. You're probably not even listening. Zubal, look at this cool bee I drew. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck are we? Where are we? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, that's no. Uh, Jesus Christ! Who's that? I wonder what this thing is. My name is Baron Theodore Mildenhall. Ben Hunting has been a hobby people. of mine for as long as I can remember. Although one could say it eventually became more of an obsession. No. The creature you see before you is one I've been pursuing for years. Not quite a man, but not quite an animal. Something unholy, something evil. I took it upon myself to spend every waking moment doing all I could to protect my family from the <clears> creature, <throat> hoping that when I'd eventually killed it, I would be freed from this awful feeling, this inescapable dread. I was wrong. You know, I'm starting to think... Think what? How about we try to find a way back up to the others? <clears throat> okay, cool, that's great. I love these adventures! <laughs> We could always ride this thing up. It's locked. It's locked, of course. It's locked. I love that it's locked. Tuesday, December 4th. Although I had shot the creature multiple times in its vitals and severed its head to keep as a prize on my wall. My troubles were just beginning. I took my eyes off the body for what felt like only a minute. And when I looked back, the body was gone. The creature was not dead. And it would be back to reclaim what I'd taken from it. If anyone is listening to this, all I ask of you is one thing. Do not let the head out of your sight. You have been warned. Well, this is some rather inconvenient lore placement. I got it! Oh shit. What? And this is some rather inconvenient darkness. <laughs> what? Was, what? That, was that you? No. Is that true the animation? Oh, wait, wait. You mean me grabbing you right now? Yeah, that was me. Is this your hand? Uh, that's my eye. Yes, but which eye? I really don't think that matters. Will you stop touching my eye? Oh, yeah, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> what happened? I just remembered a really funny joke. A you... Why did you scream then? Maybe it wasn't actually that funny. Oh my god. I think we should hold on to each other and slowly make our way back into the trophy room. Uh, sounds fine to me. What was that? What's what? That. What the That's probably just magnets. Or a boat. A boat? Whatever the case, I think we should be completely quiet. I... Okay, yeah, I agree. You know, you're really hit and miss with these things sometimes. Wait. There's a fly in here. Don't you think that's making a lot of noise? Oh, God, there is a fly. And... Gotcha! I think I got him. I can't see my hands. Um... I'm sorry, could you speak up? I couldn't quite make that out. Tommy! I think this might be the creature from the tapes! Open the fucking door! Oh, you look beautiful. Oh, 
Don't look into the light! Huh? Oh, yeah! Oh, shit! Prepare for takeoff, cause this boat is going up! Huh? That's not up! That's not up at all! Why are we going up? Up! Jesus. I do not use my adventures to torture my guests! Any torment <laughs> I inflict is 100% accidental, like any good war criminal! We weren't even talking about that! I really couldn't give less of a crap about the adventures! Then what is your problem, Zubal? I'm trying my best to remember, but both you and my brain won't tell me! <sighs> tell me, me, remember? I don't like myself. I hate this body. I hate all these stupid removable pieces. I just want to find something that feels good. Oh, yeah, now I remember why I couldn't remember. It's because that problem is already solved. Simply swap out your undesirable Zubal parts for better ones. I've been trying to find parts I like since the day I got here. So, back to the adventures. Forget it. Forget it? Just forget it. Forget what? Kane, nobody likes your stupid adventures. Ha <laughs> ha! Good one, Zubal! <laughs> I was just too nice to say anything. Jax just likes to fuck with everybody. He does Zubal fuck with too everybody! Shy to speak up. Kinger's insane, and, and Pomni, she looks traumatized every time she comes back from one. Oh, Zubal, Zubal, Jeez. Zubal, making adventures is my art! It's all I exist to do, all I'm good at. And, uh, what you're saying could imply that I'm bad at the only thing I'm good at, and that... <laughs> um. <laughs> That'd be... What's going on? Uh, whose therapy session is this again? Oh, yeah! We need to get to the bottom of your behavioral issues! The hell is that? Listen to plots, and you're gonna say the first word that comes to your mind. Uh, oh god, where are we now? I'm not sure. A cellar of some kind. And that's a corpse! Jesus Christ. Things have gotten far worse right. than I could ever have imagined. My paranoia had driven me to the point where I was no longer the protector my wife and theoretical children needed. Jumping at every shadow, every noise. I ended up shooting the love of my life, mistaking her for the creature. It's ironic, isn't it? Whoa, In my attempts whoa, whoa. to protect her, I ended up becoming the monster myself. Now I wait down in my cellar, no longer having anything to protect but my own soul. If nothing else, I will slay whoa. the beast that took everything from me. How's about we take his gun? Yeah, sounds good to yeah, me. Yeah, I have the shotgun. Please don't come alive. Okay, I won't. Looks like we've got two shots. Two bullets. Let's Bring make shot gun. Uh, yeah. Stay behind me. Oh. Oh. oh shit, the thing's back. Kinger? I, I think we may have a problem this way too. Just leave it to me. I can handle this. Let's keep the looks. Well, that was so bad. Quite. Which is what I would be saying if I didn't know that the creature was actually one of God's angels. What? And anyone who brings hey. up to it will be dragged down into the cold, spiraling pits of hell where my soul resides. Oh, yeah. I apologize, dear listener, but I need a living host in order to escape the hall of the dead, next level and your bodies will be my only means of doing so. Now wait, how did he record this if he was in hell? 
Ah! Oh shit! I hope you're ready, because the next breath you take down there will be your last, and your bodies will belong to me. Let go of me! I hate this stupid adventure! Jesus Christ! Oh, is that Martha? Mmm, good tea. Sorry again about your husband killing you and everything. Oh, you know how men are. Always having the silliest priorities. <laughs> Don't I know it. <laughs> him, I only hope he doesn't bore them to death with his endless monologues. That man could turn a 57 second story into a Greek tragedy. Oh, I'll be sure to ask the them next time I see you. Thanks again for the tea. I had a point. really nice time here. <laughs> Don't mention it. Feel free to visit anytime. Definitely. <laughs> Congratulations, my little ironclad waffle cones. You've taken the pacifist route, and you should be proud of what good people you are. Unfortunately, we still need to wait until your other teammates finish their adventure before I can grant you permission to leave. I wonder how long that'll be. Probably a couple of hours. Not really typical of what you'd think hell would be. We are literally in hell right now. Hell! Of course I'd be in hell. How could I not be in literal hell right now? Just try to stay calm. I'm sure Kane included a way to escape. Hall of the Damned. Hold on. Stop. What's that? Let me try something. Uh. Um, okay. Hey, there's actually a staircase down there. It could be a way out. Maybe it'll work for us since we still have our bodies? Though I'm worried about what that tape said earlier. I'm just gonna try going fast. Wait, Pommy! Pommy! Oh, jeez. What the hell is happening? Pommy! Don't! souls are attracted to living things just want a vessel to be able to leave with man seven years of computer science for this huh <laughs> why <laughs> every day i spend here is one nightmare after the next i knew it would end up like this he just wants me to suffer i really am in hell don't say that you're not in well i I guess well, we are technically in. Forget about that. How about we just relax for a bit while nothing's chasing us? <laughs> it was my fault we went down this path, wasn't it? Suffers. I'm really just just for that. Why have you? been acting so different lately. <laughs> I have. My name's here. I? You're gonna be alright now. I'm normally not too good with memories. But being surrounded by darkness always brings me back to a certain time. Oh, some law? Right Go after forward. my wife had abstracted. Your wife I don't extracted. recall the exact string of events, but we both ended up in the fort together. And it was dark. The darkness seemed to calm her down a bit. The harsh, jagged edges smoothed out, and she didn't seem aggravated anymore. She wasn't the same as before, but she was calm enough to touch one last time before she got sent to the cellar. Oh, shit. I'm always taken back to that moment when engulfed in darkness. You had a wife? Like, was it here in the circus? Yeah. She was funny, creative, really into entomology. 
I used to hate bugs, but she somehow got me to like them. It's not the most cheerful memory, but it's one I at least have control over. Mm. Is that thoughts with memories? I know how I can feel in this circus. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it all just feels pointless. Yeah. But it's not. Not if you have people who care about you. Good memories can do a lot. Hold on to them. And cherish the people around you. <laughs> you never know when they'll be gone. In this world, the worst thing you can do is make someone think they're not wanted or loved. I'm glad you're here with me. You know, I've been thinking about that last tape. He said, the next breath you take down there will be your last. Maybe we can get through if we don't breathe. I'm not very good at holding my breath. Well, how about we try not thinking about it? Yeah. Uh if we leave and we go back to the circus, you're just gonna go back to being crazy. You're not gonna remember any of this, are you? Don't worry about me. As long as you remember it, things will be okay. You're very strong, Pommy. <laughs> and I know you'll be able to get through this. Just hold on to me. We'll get through it together. You ready? Is it scary? Right. I'm fine, actually. What happened up here? Uh, don't worry about that. Pommy was very brave. At least I think You're she done was. good, Pommy. Were you? You're done good. Something like that. Hey, Ragatha. Yeah? I just want to say thanks for always being concerned about me. I feel like through everything. I haven't really been appreciative enough about that. Uh, oh, thank you, Pomni. I just want to make sure you're doing all right. You know, we care about you. Did you remember to get my comedy mask? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and and <laughs> I was starting to wonder if the Wild West was even a real direction at all. Whoopsie daisy, looks like everybody completed the adventure and they're coming home. Quick, pretend we weren't having a therapy session. Okay. Welcome back, my meowing milkmaids. <laughs> Don't ever call us that again. <laughs> <laughs> so what was it like being stuck with the nutcase? It wasn't that bad, actually. Yo, that was good! Jesus Christ! We got some more lore about some of the characters. Alright guys, that was it for this video. If you guys enjoyed the video, come on like, subscribe, and the notification bells turn on until then. Keep them your bloody head down! <laughs> <laughs>